वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल आई एम माधुरी योर गो टू पर्सन फॉर ऑल थिंग्स हायर एजुकेशन करियर एंड सेल्फ डेवलपमेंट सब्सक्राइब नाउ एंड डोंट फर्गेट टू क्लिक ऑन द बेल आईकॉन टू गेट नोटिफाइड वेन आई पब्लिश न्यू वीडियोज टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू बी टॉकिंग अबाउट द एडवांस्ड मैनेजमेंट प्रोग्राम इन बिजनेस एनालिटिक्स कोर्स offered by the indian school of business i'll be talking about the details of the course what it entails what you learn throughout the program the duration eligibility criteria fee structure and application process throughout the video we'll keep exploring whether the advanced management program in business analytics is the right course for you this video is being created on demand as many of you reached out in the comment section of my previous videos requesting me to cover this topic if you are one of them here's a special welcome for you if not here's your reminder that if there is a topic you would like me to talk about or have questions about please mention it in the comment section so that i can create that video specially for you for now let's get started what is the advanced management program in business analytics it is a 15 month part time program offered by isp it focuses on equipping professionals with the skills needed to make data driven decisions and is open for individuals who have a bachelor's or masters degree in engineering technology statistics mathematics and science or any other equivalent qualification with exposure to mathematics and programming you need to have a minimum of 2 years of work ex to be able to apply let's talk about the curriculum before jumping into the admission process and the selection criteria the 15 month course is divided into three parts first is the foundation term that spans 2 months it covers topics on statistics probability data collection and pre processing and data visualization through online classes on weekends these courses lay the groundwork for what you'll be learning in the main course which is the second part The second part is the main coursework. It spans 10 months with 5 terms of 6 to 8 weeks each. At the beginning of each term, you will spend 5 days on the ISP campus for in-person learning and for the rest of the weeks it will be covered online. Throughout the 5 terms, there will be tons of assignments, mini projects and opportunities to learn from your peers, expert industry speakers and group projects. ISP does a frequent review of the course modules and makes amends to cover recent advances in data science and its applications in a business domain so that students are up to speed with the industry. The last part is the capstone project that spans through the final 3 months of the program. It allows you to apply your learning from classroom to solve real world business problems. For this capstone project you'll be working in a group and you will have a mentor either an isb faculty or someone from the industry and for the topic of your project you have the option of working on a current project from your own organization or bid for projects that isb brings on board from other organizations and some of the top companies that have offered live projects to isb students in the past include like top tech companies that are also consultancies isb has made sure that just like their flagship pgp program this program also has international faculty so that you will get a holistic learning experience to apply to this course you either need to take a test conducted by isb or you can request a waiver by sub meeting your gmat gre and mac or your cat scores if you don't get a waiver for the exception you will need to take that test conducted by isb it's a 2 hour test on data interpretation logical reasoning probability and statistics i have attached a link to the isb website's page where they have shared a sample question paper for this test along with this you will have to submit an online application with your resume pay stubs from the last 2 months and passport size color photos wherever needed if your application is shortlisted you will be invited for an in person interview or online interview depending on a variety of factors the admissions committee will then evaluate your application along with your interview performance and send out an admit or a reject letter this shortlisting happens on a rolling basis meaning the sooner you apply the sooner they'll make a decision on your application and if all seats get filled by the time you apply you'll automatically be given a deferred admission to the next batch speaking of the monetary aspect the application fee is 2000 indian rupees and the course fee is approximately 11 lakhs excluding tax you have to bear the additional cost of travel to and from campus for each term but your stay on campus will be complimentary you can also request your company need to sponsor your fees for this course by convincing them how the course will help you get better at your current role and potentially help you move up the ladder to make a difference to the company in this case you'll have to submit a support letter from
from your company's HR stating that they will be sponsoring you for the course and how the course will benefit not only you but also the company. It's best if you can attach the support letter to the application but it's okay to send it in later as well. The next batch of this course is set to begin in July 2024 and applications are still open. They have an upcoming deadline of March 17, 2024 in case you want to apply right away. I have mentioned the link to the course page from ISB's website in the description box and also pinned it in the comment section. Go for this course if you feel you want to enhance your business skills and move on from your tech role into a management position in the short term or the long term. The best part is that you'll be learning while working so your career track won't entirely be on pause and you'll get to make an impact right away in your role even while preparing for the next step in your career. If you have any questions about this course, feel free to mention them in the comment section and I'll get back to you with details. Hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe before you leave. Thank you for watching.